everyone, Jessica here. I'm so excited it's finally October. Halloween's by far my favorite holiday and I have some really cool designs to show you guys. For my first video this season, I've been painting some spooky jack lantern silhouettes that also glow under a black light. These look really detailed but they're actually quite simple to do. The base of this design is two coats of orange cream dream. Using sweater weather, a makeup sponge, and a tweezer, I'm going to sponge the top half of the nail. Once you are happy with your fade, cure it in your LED light for 30 seconds. Now continue to sponge, focusing on the top one third of the nail. This will darken up the ombre. When your fade is complete, cure for 30 seconds. Now you apply one solid coat of close your fingers and cross your eyes. Cure for 30 seconds. Using black shadow, I'm going to paint in the shape of my pumpkins. You want this to be a little translucent. then cure for 30 seconds. With a thin brush and arctic freeze, I'm going to paint in the eyes and mouth of each pumpkin. I went out of frame a little bit there, basically I just painted a zigzag line for the mouth. For your second pumpkin, make sure you switch up the shapes to give it a little more character. Now cure for 30 seconds. Using black shadow and a brush, I'm going to darken up the top of the fade. If you need to blend it out a little bit more, you can use your sponge and help fade it down. Using Street Credible, go over the eyes and mouth of the pumpkin. This color is a nice bright shade that gives a glowing effect. Then cure for 30 seconds. Now using black shadow and your striper brush, you're going to outline each pumpkin, paint around the eyes and mouth, and add in a couple details for your jack-o'-lanterns.
Now I'm going to paint on the handle of the jack-o'-lantern and add a little squared off curly Q. Add in a few more squared curly cues coming from the top downwards. Then cure for 30 seconds. With orange cream dream, paint in a thin line separating the two jack-o'-lanterns. Next, use Street Credible to outline the top of each jack-o'-lantern. This will make the design really pop and also looks really cool under a black light. When you're done, cure for 30 seconds. The final step is to apply an even coat of Top It Off. Once you've cured and cleansed the nail, your design is complete. Using my LED lamp, I'm showing you the effect it will have under a black light. Thanks so much for watching. If you liked my video, make sure you subscribe below so you don't miss any of my upcoming Halloween designs.